and in the first century, the way I died was that um, the people that were closest to us actually finished up causing my death. And, and you know, so, so for Mary and myself, that's an issue we've had to work through um, in this life, just how much the people who were closest to us affected us. And what, what we've found is that um, one of the emotions that we've both had is, is a fear of getting too close to people that are really close because, and particularly when their emotional condition isn't one of love yet, because they make assumptions about who we are and what we're doing and things like that, and then they make decisions based on those emotions that are often out of harmony with love, and that's what actually created my death in the first century. So, understandably, uh, Mary also has this feeling of, uh, you know, being afraid to even be exposed in a public way uh, or even in a private way about um, and, and the effects that, that that exposure may have later down the track. Um, so, a lot of people, what a lot of people do is they make assumptions in their own heart about what should be happening. And this happens already a lot in my life where people think, well, if he was really Jesus, he should be doing this and he should be doing that and he should be doing this and he should be doing that. Not understanding that I'm coming from a different place to what they're coming from. I'm coming from this place of what would God do in this situation, not, with, not what would man do in this situation. But in the first century, most of the disciples were coming from the point of view of what would a man do in this situation. And they were very, very interested in setting me up as like a king over the Jews. And in the process of doing that, they created conflicts that were unnecessary around me. And they basically created a conflict situation <coughs> and then threw me in the middle of it unawares, and which often I would have to then work my way through. And, um, and it happened in each case because they weren't trusting of what I was saying to them, that my kingdom was no part of this world, that you know, it wasn't anything to do with this earth-based life that I was talking about so much, aside from this state of bliss. And so, naturally, um, a lot of Mary's feelings, even about people that are close to us, can often be feeling like, oh, but what are they going to do next? You know, they're nice to us now, but what might they do next? And, um, and the truth is that um, already in the time she's been with me, there's been a number of people that have been quite close to me who have then gone down the track of ridicule or, or, or doing things that are out of harmony with love through their anger um, that, have, that have affected us and could, and could have affected us negatively uh, if, if we were in different conditions. So, um, so that's a big, big emotion to go through for, for the both of us.